So what's it like having new misfit kids on the block? And what's it like being the guy who's returning? Not enjoying it, but I'll tell you, both incredibly racist. Uh, no, it's brilliant, mate. It's absolutely wonderful. It's lovely to be to be back doing, definitely. And it's and it's wonderful to come back. Yeah, it's wonderful to come back, and it's wonderful to spend this well, this time with these dicks. <laughs> Thanks for that, man. Cheers. No worries. Thanks. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah. What did you think of him before you actually uh, got on set? Just from having seen him on the show. Just didn't like the look of him. Mm. Shifty, dodgy. He, he has his hands in his pockets a lot for stuff, and that I kind of <laughs> <laughs> always fidgeting. Bit of strange. Oh, yeah. Coins. I've got to try to find change. You can't see it on camera. It doesn't register in person. He's always got a really thin film of snot on his top. <laughs> I've got problems, yeah, I've got nerves. It's all in my sinus, I've got sinus problems. He'll sweat loads if you just zoom in here right now. (laughs) (laughs) I do, I'm wearing a lot of layers. You can see it now on the top of his head, actually. Look, I'm wearing like... I've not been very well, so I'm wearing a couple of layers here at Comic-Con. I'm wearing one, two, that's three, four, five... And that's my sixth layer. As if that's going to prevent passing on the disease. It's it's getting rid of flu, it's getting rid of me, me man flu. Well, you haven't quite got the power to overcome the flu yet, but which one of you actually got the short straw when the superpowers were handed out in the show? Definitely. Oh, well, yeah. oh, I don't you, know, you don't, Yeah, you don't know what it is yet, but yeah. You, you don't wait. know what my power is until... Yeah. Well, yeah, it's, it's just, just upsetting. Don't want it. It's not oh, all right. It's yeah. the bottom of Howard Overman's brain barrel. Yeah. It's disgusting. Oh, it's just <laughs> minging. <laughs> Fucking hard. Like, yeah. People are going to see me and be like, oh, yeah, you're a misfit. Then after a week, it's going to be... I genuinely don't want to be mad. Mine, mine is... Brilliant. It's pretty cool, yeah. It's yours. Yeah, yeah, yours is brilliant, but he like can't X-Man fucking use crap with it. Is he's cool, but he's uh, in in, in with yeah, fit, running cool. fame with the show. He's crap at it. Yeah. Well, I'm brilliant with mine. But <laughs> I don't. I don't want to have it. So <laughs> Matt, you don't even get to don the orange jumpsuit, do you? No, no he I doesn't. Don't, you know. No. I'm <laughs> he's constantly <laughs> winding up about it. Do you feel you've been picked on then? Initially, <laughs> do you know what? I, initially, I thought, oh, that's really bad because it's kind of quintessentially. But then I realised how. Disgusting these two looked in orange jumps. Come on. It just accentuates all of the kind of camel toes. <laughs> you can proper see camel toes. You've got nipples yeah, you have got face straight, straight down, <laughs> and you can probably see that. It's just big enough. Thought, it's oh, camel leather jacket, that's all right. It's a bit cool now. So. You can proper see mm. Frank and Beans through it. Yeah. I'm not joking. <laughs> so I'm not kidding. Talking of which, you two guys have got a bit of a bromance going Ooh, on, haven't you? We do. Yeah. Tell us a bit more. Mm, yeah. We do have a bromance, don't we? Yeah, we do. Don't yeah. Where it's come from? Because I hate it. Don't like small people. <laughs> Racist as well, too. Like it's, it's quite, they get quite emotional. <laughs> get really irritated. It's, it's, they get quite emotional, I think, Moody and Finn. Yeah, they? there is a bit of a, there's a, we have a bit of a fallout at one point. Are we allowed yeah. to talk about that, our fallout? We do have a lover's tiff right. where he kicks me out and uh, I have, where do I live? After? Uh, I've only just shot it. You sleep on the street for a while. I do sleep on the street. Really I have sex with a tramp. With a, with quite a beautiful tramp girl. But they kind of unite in just taking <laughs> the piss out of me. Yeah, like, they, they yeah. seem to they, they bond because yeah. they just, I hate them. <laughs> <laughs> I like, and then in Misfits, my character hates them as well. Weird. So it, it, that, that's kind of their So the bullying point. is necessary. Yeah, they just unite. They're, they're bigger, but then whenever I'm in the mix, it's suddenly two verse one, really. And, and I can see there might be a, quite an interesting atmosphere on set just from talking to you guys now. Tell us a little bit about it and who gets up to the prank? Who's, who's the biggest there's prank player? There's a lot of simulated monster. rape. Simulated yeah. rape's disgusting. Yeah. He pulls up your pants and pats you on the back. I no, kiss him on the like, neck and good, good lad. Rests on me after it. <laughs> oh. Oh. It's just we were saying, like in the in the the um, what's it called, the press thing, that if you've got an insecurity, it's everyone else's responsibility to just completely go for it. <laughs> Bring so it like, out. Literally within like a week, Joe just declared to everyone that I had a massive Viking head. It is, which though, he has. Look at the size you, of that compared think, to his head. Look at the difference. That tiny little pea head compared and to And I him. always thought, ah, that's all right. Our heads are in size order. <laughs> <laughs> like a you think you try and detach a bit <laughs> of <laughs> attention away from it, but now he's got this on his face he's as well. He's gone yeah. for that. He's gone for that. Just mm. thought it maybe looked Nonce! <laughs> <laughs> Guys, in real life, what superpower would you most like to have? Real life. Um, mm. I got in trouble for this the other day. Cause it ended up just <laughs> tell them. Tell them what I it was. I got asked this question the other day and I said I'd go back in time and I'd stop One Direction's parents from ever having sex. Um, yeah. Who's that one in One Direction that just does loads of shagging? Harry Styles. Yeah. Harry Styles, yeah. stop doing it. Stop yeah. shagging or you're going to ca- he'll ca- he'll get some. i close somewhere. Harry Styles' penis. <laughs> close it, power. close it in on it. I'd use it once. <laughs> I'd just get really close, do that, and that'd be it. <laughs>
Now that's the kind of advice that Rudy couldn't give Harry Styles, isn't it? Really? I'd like to go. I'd like yeah. the power to go out with Harry Styles and be knobbed by him because clearly I'm missing out on something. He's just shagging everyone, isn't he? He's just going around, throwing it around, <laughs> lobbing it all over the place. Our boss is over there listening in. She's a liberal woman. She's very liberal. Would you be friends with your characters in real life? And would you, as Rudy, like a second you? And what would you do if you did have a second you? No, I, I would hate him. In I'd, hate life, yeah. I'd, mm. hate, I'd, I'd hate the parents. I'd hate. I do. I hate the parents. They'd be so irritated. They'd be very. <laughs> just because they're just terrible human beings. And there's all these scenes when we're all together, and they're blah, 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 bickering. He's away, got to be cool. And, and Alex goes, right. Do you know what? Let, let's just do this, and they go, shut up. Let's just do this and recycle the <laughs> We were all ad libbing it. We never wrote in, but we were such bad. Every time I chip in, they go, that's brilliant. Let's do what Alex said, but we'll high fives like this. Credit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Guys. Eight yeah. episodes of that. <laughs> We've had a night. We genuinely have a frigging brilliant time. Everyone says this, like you know, we all we all get on. We all have a great time. We have a great it's time. The best job it's the frigging entire hilarious. World. Very stressful and fall out a lot, but you do end up. You rock up now and again, and after about three months, when it starts off, you kind of it's all about the filming and stuff. But after about three months, you literally rock up to dick about with your mates, and then someone around. someone eventually stressed out with the headset on comes. And goes like, we have a frig. You have to do a bit work now. You're like, oh fuck well. yeah, yeah. Come on, you hear that from behind monitor? Yeah. Come on. <laughs> Come on! No laughing in this one. Oh, yeah, yeah. Which of the episodes are you most looking forward to seeing and why? Six is just a massive episode. It's a massive, yeah. so much happens in episode six. It's kind of like the, the, the You don't know what one that is, do you? <coughs> you're, that's what, mm? yeah. Oh yeah, we all end up, we all end up going rabbit. to a party in episode six that is yeah, Rudy's that's mate, that's Richie all. Saunders. And, um, we, giant killer rabbit. There's a giant killer rabbit shows up, Ooh. and we all have to kind of make a six foot killer rabbit with a golf club. The bloke who played the rabbit, I might add, was called Jack. Jack Rabbit. Yeah. It actually was his name. Really and nice. Really nice. I was I'm going to that. Yeah, yeah, he's called Jack. He's handsome as hell and quite well, strong. Wasn't he? Yeah. On. You never saw it. Yeah. Never saw really it. Good beautifully good handsome. He was. Take for it though, he is, yeah. You could salute and cry at the same time. Jack. <laughs> 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 Sorry. Does that make you feel better about not having a jumpsuit, knowing that there's this really good-looking guy, but he's under a rabbit suit? Yeah, because yeah, every time we saw him, he was just covered in sweat and wretching. <laughs> <Yeah>. Wretching. <laughs> wretching. Wretching because like, of his own so breath. So made us feel great, yeah. Yeah. What we didn't mention, he had terrible gingivitis and had to breathe inside that thing the whole day. Yeah, he had a bit of herpes in the corner of his mouth as well. So. <laughs> and crabs, he had crabs. <laughs> On his face. On in oh. his eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> Which of these two do you think looks best in the jumpsuit? Neither of them. What are you Literally. on about? You've seen Neither the camel's toe. If you have to pick one... one. No. Who would it it's, be? It's, it, it's like looking at a bloody bin bag full of cottage cheese. I'll <laughs> say this. I'll say this about the fucking jumpsuits. Is he's fitted? Is he's been? <laughs> yeah. His yeah. has been tailor fitted. And in the early photographs, you can properly see. <laughs> <his dick. laughs> you can really you see generous, his dick and balls. <laughs> the, honestly, the most revealing things without being revealing went, at all. They went round mother care trying to find an orange jumpsuit. <laughs> they just didn't do it. So they had to make their own ones. <laughs> Stitch that one in. Stitch that in for we'll him. Just get a couple of place. orange hankies and just turn them in. Does Action Man wear an orange? <laughs> he genuinely does have weighty balls. They fucking look well heavy. Apples. Banging into each other. <laughs> fucking uh, Sorry. <laughs> That was kind of a Thanks for having us. Yeah. 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 Yeah.